Wise monkey. Well, yeah, you know, you could call it a bit silly. It was a bit silly, and I was a bit silly because you were a bit silly, right? I mean, in your fine art study, do you study context? Because, you know, I was talking about how uh, I had, and others had called some of Fred's video artistic in nature or intent. We were starting our interpretation, and that's what I'm discussing with Fred. I didn't say, I make fine art. I said, oh, everything, all YouTubes are expression. I did not say everything in the universe. But to me, art has to do with expressing internal ideas. It doesn't have to do with having to be great at it because that's a matter of opinion. One person's great musician is another person's noise and racket maker. So that's the context. And you start in on comments that I am taking, I am taking upon myself. I'm just puffing myself up because I have claimed that my videos are fine art. No, I never said that. You, you took all art in a very egalitarian, obviously anything could be counted as art. And you put the word fine on it, which was ridiculous. You could pretend, oh, well, we just get confused in comments. No, you brought up fine art and called it fine art and said that it was fine art and made a big deal about it. Fine art, fine art. And that I was making a claim, like I made a video. Oh, I just want to make a video, everybody. My videos are art. <laughs> so that video I made to anybody that actually has something to say about philosophy of art whether they agree with me or not, there's issues there, like things to disagree with me about. And that I'm claiming to make fine art on YouTube is just not one of them, right? And then when you talk about universally accepted canon, yeah, universally accepted by, by the people that matter, yeah, right, prove that one, okay? It's universally among the very small minority that care, I mean, whatever you know and when you make the side little comments about some crack potteries and I, I agree um, but I have a feeling you won't be specific because my crack pottery is just following science with a little bit of speculation crack pottery no what that comes from is that you are someone that seems easily swayed by universally accepted canons will fire your cannons as much as you want in my direction. Okay. Yes, no hard feelings. I don't think you're a thorough, thorough elitist. I don't doubt the eclectic nature of your music collection. Quite the opposite. That's why I threw back so quickly elitism, because it's pretty hard to be an artistic elitist in this world anymore. But you're trying. Okay you do have some elitist attitudes about this. Just, if you want to say, well, that's not art, but I like it, why can't we just say I like it? Well, there's a lot of reasons. Because I get down to fundamental kind of definitions that use some sort of principle that you can apply into nature. So expressing an idea from the head, there's some interesting philosophical difficulties with that, but that's the gist I'm getting at with art. 